But our sources confirmed this morning that it is, in fact, young Mazi. Naima Abdullahi is live this morning. Naima, you are the one that have confirmed with your sources. What more are they saying about the shooting? Sheba, that close friend tells me on camera that the young rapper was shot and killed outside of this pizza place, walking into his car. Now, that friend says today is a sad day for the Atlanta hip hop community. Another Atlanta rapper gunned down. Now, here's what we have been able to confirm with police, although they have not identified young Mozzie. From what we know, the shooting happened at this pizza restaurant located at the intersection of Oakview Road and Hosea Williams Drive. A little before 9 p.m., the victim was found with multiple gunshot wounds and police believe he was targeted. The close friend, BWA Kane, is now on his way back to Atlanta to pay his respects to Mozzie's close circle. He says it's sad to see his friend not reach his potential as an up-and-coming artist in Atlanta. Man, it, just, it hurts so bad to see that the hate is that deep. Like, man, so much jealousy and hate in the world today. I mean, if we could just come together and stop the violence and support one another. And all morning long, I've been talking to people in the Atlanta hip hop community, event promoters, different managers, different close friends of Young Mozzie, and they all say today is a tragic day for the hip hop community. We also talked to a family member of the young rapper who says he's not ready to go on camera, but he says that the family is going to have a hard time dealing with this situation because the rapper has children um, and the rapper is fully invested in the community here, which shows in the condolences we've seen on social media from big name artists as well and social media has really taken off with this so hopefully we'll find out more information from APD about the investigation and wait for a full confirmation from them Sheba and Naima as we hear about this shooting uh, we, we can't help but think about the shooting last year in which young Mazi was shot at at the Buckhead Waffle House Right, and I was covering that story back in December when the shooting happened at the Waffle House in Buckhead, where the rapper was shot uh, three times and was taken to the hospital in critical condition. Uh, the rapper told police uh, prior to that he had been shot 10 times, um, eventually leading to one controversial tweet where he said he was bulletproof. Uh, Mozzie also posted a video on his social media accounts addressing all the different shootings that have happened to him and his family, uh, his close friends, everyone online is saying, you know, it's sad that this has happened to him. And we're still waiting from, uh, to get confirmation from APD, so we'll see how everything ties together as they continue to investigate. Naima Abdullahi, thank you. She is our music source here at 11 Alive. Appreciate you uh, bringing us up to date on this and calling all your sources. The news of young Mozzie's death comes as people are still remembering another rapper's death. Just last week, hashtag long live bankroll had been trending on Twitter. Atlanta rapper Bankroll Fresh was shot and killed outside a local recording studio last year. He would have been 30 this month. The person responsible for killing Bankroll is still out there today.